All right, and here we are doing a refrag restrat tutorial. This is everything you need to know how to do to deploy a demo into restrat and or use restrat. So from the website, first things first, we will go ahead and upload a demo. We'll just do test demo, pick a date, and we'll pick the, uh, like, let's say liquid gambit demo. We will then upload the demo takes a few seconds obviously based on the speed on your of your internet um, after the upload is done then it does a quick parsing this usually takes 15 20 seconds after the demo is uploaded then the demo is ready to be played inside of the game server you will get this loading page um, and when it's done we will see the dashboard all right and looks like the demo is done parsing you can go ahead and click into the demo you get a quick uh, overview of the rounds you can actually start the demo from any of these individual rounds these are clickable you'll see which utility was used or sorry bought in those rounds uh, how many kills these each person got so you kind of know who to watch the amount of money spent how the round was won whether it was a defusal the bomb exploded or they ran out of time um, you'll notice this notes section down here which is very important um, the ability obviously to delete the demo and then the key um, that most people want is this start demo function so First things first, you will upload the demo. You will then join the server. You'll click the start button. You can see in the bottom right, demo successfully loaded on the server. So as long as you're inside the server, it knows which server you're in, and then it will start the demo. Here we are in the game server. So it goes ahead and downloads the demo to the game server, puts you inside of it, and it starts the demo. So you can see we have the demo that we just loaded from the website here, and we can start to explore the mods uh, and the functions of the restrat tool. So I am inside of a game server. As you can see, I have uh, a ping on the left and you can see that everybody else is a bot. I'll turn on NetGraph so you can see that I am in fact actually inside of a game server. And the beauty of Restrat is the ability to watch demos with your teammates in real time together. You can watch them, you can play versus them, uh, but the most important thing for teams that don't have practice houses is the ability to watch a demo in real time together and everybody can watch the individual POVs of everybody in real time. Let me turn off no flash so I don't get flashed anymore. Um, but it is crucial to being able to watch individual POVs in real time so you can see exactly where you and your teammates missed, um, missed, you know, miscommunicated, missed your shots, maybe your angle was off. Um, so I am in the spectate right now of a server and the demo is playing back exactly how it happened inside of the uh, demo um, or sorry, uh, from the match. And we have built in some really nifty, um, you know, functions, everything that you would need to do from a demo viewing perspective, pausing and playing and speeding up and slowing down and rewinding and everything is instant. There is no delay. We have fixed the problems of this so you can see I'm just skipping forwards in a round and I'm going forward obviously that is very normal for most people but going backwards is the crucial thing and we've got some nice binds to speed up the demo and we got some nice binds to slow down the demo and in the event that there was a uh, other person in here or my entire team in here or a group of friends we we're all seeing the same thing in real time together and I can spectate one person, they can spectate another. When I pause the demo, we all see the same thing in real time together. Very, um, very important to be able to do this. So this is uh, just the beginning of what you're able to do. I will load up the menu here and we can pause this for a second and we can kind of go through some of these options that you have. The demo menu is a playing back of recordings we're controlling the demo so we have a demo loaded currently we have all of these pause play fast forward increase speed slow down these are useful much more useful on binds which we will provide you with um, than actually hitting those keys here so um, that is what the demo menu control is the demo control is oh sorry the same thing is from within the demo menu uh, it's the same option just from another menu um, the observer menu is something very important for our people that are analyzing demos and that are kind of controlling the camera. So this is where kind of all the magic happens. You can set people to watch individual players. So you can see lock players to their targets. I'm going to set myself to watch Naphany and then I will press number one to lock me to Naphany. 
And as you can see, I just locked myself to Naphany. So now, no matter what I do, when I click mouse on, I cannot change away from this. This is very important for teams that have these players that you know you're watching a demo and you're not watching the right people um, this really solves that and you can lock individual players to individual people so if you were like let's say you're watching your own demo and you as the coach want to lock people to watch the right people you can set yourself to watch yourself and your teammate to watch himself and another teammate to watch themselves and everything stays synced in real time um, this other number three uh, option is observe me so now i have set that and you can see it says put everybody to spectator um, and it's watching me that means everybody's camera is locked to who i watch so no matter who i'm watching everybody is watching me um, there's also another option here to put everybody into spectator so if there were multiple multiple people um, i could just press one key and it will put these users directly into spectate uh, really streamlines the process of watching a demo um, the last thing is the versus mode and this is the ability for you to play against the demo. So we will go ahead and load up around where there's an execute and I will show you uh, what this does. All right, and here we are in a demo where I know where there's an execute. Uh, I just loaded this up quickly from the website and I know that the terrorists uh, do an A execute here. So I'm gonna go ahead and set the server game mode from watch. I'm gonna press number eight. It's gonna put it into versus mode. I'm then gonna go to versus settings and I'm gonna turn off the uh, CT team by pressing number five. And now I am a player on the team and Navi is going to do exactly what they did inside the demo. Um, this is a great way for you and your team to see the power of your strategy or somebody else's strategy in real time and see the, the feeling of it. Um, we have two options here. We have the bot versus mode in normal, which means they're going to shoot back at me. And there's a bot versus mode on ignore. And ignore means they're going to do exactly what they did in the demo and they're going to ignore what I do. Um, I can shoot them and they will not shoot back. Uh, so I'll just go ahead and kill this first guy here and you can see that nothing really happened. And this is a great way for you to see exactly kind of what a team execute feels like. And I'm going to go ahead and turn it on to normal mode here. And this is where they're going to react to me. Normal mode means they do exactly what they did in the demo, but they will, they will, uh, they will shoot back at me and I will obviously die, but I can shoot back at them as well. And it's, it's a really fun way to play against a pro team's demo for you to see exactly what you know it really feels like you can obviously do your own demo and and play against yourself and see what that feels like as well um that is a let me pause this for a second um that is inside of this versus mode settings here you have a little bit more control over it you can make the bot difficulty a little harder or easier you can obviously go to t side as well so if you wanted to play against the ct side setup and practice taking a bomb site or whatever but this is mostly a uh, a thing that you practice on CT side where you can have a team execute against you, but you have a little bit of control over the options here. Um, and yeah, it's a, a, a really cool way for you to play against also what happens in, in, in demos, but you can also use this um, yourself. So I'm going to go ahead and um, close this demo and we can do this ourselves. So we also have this record mode function as well if you saw this on the menu um, inside of the record mode you have two options you can do a solo recording or you can do a team recording um, and i'll go t side actually for demonstration purposes so i'm going to do a solo recording um, and what this does is it gives you the option to record with up to five players meaning you can record an individual pov and you can kind of glue them all together so we provided these nifty little spawn points so that you know i'm going to use a spawn point six here i'm going to start recording and i'm going to be player one doing a nice flash over ramp and i'm going to run out ramp and clear this i will then end this player's um, uh, movement. And I'm gonna go back and do another player. Let's say he uses this spawn point here and I started recording for him and I'm gonna throw this smoke. This allows players and coaches to essentially record entire strategies for their teams and practice it, you know, or show them uh, later on. And I'm going to end that 
and then now you can go to number six and do start all and now you can see the two little dots they're about to do what i just did so it allows you to essentially replicate what i just recorded and glues them all together and allows you to record individual povs but have them and uh glued together there's another option here which is the uh, team recording so if you had your whole team in the server and you wanted to dry run a strategy you can you just go to the team recording here you click start recording it'll restart the round and the same thing applies if there was a bunch of other people in the server it would do the same thing so i'm just gonna wing some smokes for demonstration purposes and throw this oh, didn't do my jump throw and just imagine there was a whole team of people with me doing this and I'm going to end this. And then now I can play that demo back. Um, and now you can see that I'm, or he's about to do the exact same thing. And what I was talking about earlier is the ability to do this inside of versus mode. So I can do versus. And then now I can go to CT side and I can play against my execute or I can watch it, whichever one I want to do. I can make it so they can shoot back at me or not shoot back at me. But this allows you to dry run your strategy and then practice against it and see it in real time and see what it feels like and the timing and find what the vulnerabilities are. Wow, that guy's nuts. Um, find what the vulnerabilities are and find out exactly what a team or how a team is going to react to your strategy. There is a um, note-taking functionality. Let me go ahead and close this. Uh, note-taking functionality that's really important when you're watching demos. I'm gonna go ahead and load a demo up from the website and uh, I can show you. All right, and here we are. I've loaded a demo up for demonstration purposes to show you the dot note functionality, which allows you to save notes or take notes while watching a demo. Um, so I'll go ahead and fast forward this up for a little bit to get into the meat of a round. And we can say electronic is really good. Um, and then you can see in chat it says note saved. And we'll do this a few more times just for demonstration purposes. I'll go to a few more rounds and speed up. And then we'll do dot note. This was and eco and as you can see it says note saved um, this saves the note from the exact round and the exact time in the round but most importantly it saves this note onto the dashboard um, which i'm going to show you here in a second so here we are now on the dashboard and this is the demo i have loaded up and as you can see um, this is the demo between navi and spirit and you can see these were the two notes that I took and it shows the round and it shows the time remaining in the round that the note was taken as well as the note. And really importantly, it says start demo from note. Um, you click this button, it starts the demo from that note for everybody to watch in real time. So I'll go ahead and click this one here, start demo from note. And um, you'll see in the bottom right, demo successfully loaded to server. We will go back into Counter-Strike now. And as you can see, it started the, the note from exactly before this uh, execute happens, which is actually the execute that uh, I showed you earlier. So basically everything you'd ever needed as a, as a player, as a coach to be able to watch demos, to be able to practice, dry run, perform at the highest of your ability, we have provided all of these tools inside of the server. Um, and everybody can use it at the same time. So anyway, this was the refrag restrat tutorial. Thank you.